during each lunar month the moon changes from not being fully illuminated to being full illuminated there are eight distinct traditionally recognized stages of the moon which are also referred to as its phases a new moon occurs when the moon and the sun rise and set at the same time the waxing crescent occurs 2 days after the new moon the moon rises 1 hours behind the sun and follows it during the day the first quarter appears a week after the new moon the moon rises at noon and sets around midnight the sun and the moon are 90 degrees apart in the sky waxing gibbous occurs between the first and second week after the new moon the moon rises before sunset and sets after midnight a full moon occurs 2 weeks after the new moon as the sun sets in the west the moon rises as the sun rises at dawn the moon sets The waning gibbous occurs a few days after a full moon. The moon rises after sunset and sets between sunrise and noon. The last quarter occurs 3 weeks after the new moon. The moon rises around midnight and sets around noon. The waning crescent occurs during the 4th week. The moon rises in the east before dawn and during the morning the moon sets ahead of the sun below the western horizon the lunar cycle repeats itself with each new moon now you know why the moon looks different every night so hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for watching more interesting videos like this one